Poverty is not an unavoidable part of life. It's not the result of fate or of absolute lack of resources for everyone. Poverty is the result of inequality and injustice. It's the result of a political and economic and cultural model in which a small minority benefits disproportionately and immediately at the price of the deprivation and the suffering and the chronic failure of the vast majority of people. And this injustice includes depriving most of humanity from the essential material and non-material benefits from biodiversity and ecosystems. According to this deeply unfair model, the destruction of biodiversity of the fabric of life is the necessary price to pay for progress and development. And whatever little is left from the natural world is for the rich, for the rich to worry about and for the rich to enjoy. But poverty is not a natural state of things. We just bought into that model. We also thought that it was normal not to send women to school, that slavery was normal. And with time, we changed that. And we claim back our, our rights to education and to freedom. So now we have the historic opportunity to start thinking that poverty is not natural, that is something deeply unfair that has to be changed. And the underpinning consumption model also has to be changed. And in this process, we can claim back essential human rights, including the right we all have to enjoy the fabric of life.